Well, there's no problem. If you had a gun, shoot him in the head. Hey guys, up here for TFB TV at NRAM 2023. It's the NRA annual meeting. We're over at the High Point booth We're talking about the new carbine in a new caliber. I was hoping you could walk us through it. <laughs> yeah, so what we're looking at is the 3095 Super Carry carbine. As far as we know at this point, still, we're the only manufacturer doing a carbine in that cartridge. So it's pretty simple. This is pretty much the same size as the 995 carbine, obviously in 30 Super Carry. But what this thing kind of does is kind of becomes like our 380 carbine. It's a fit niche gun for the people that aren't big gun guys and they have like, they had the pocket 380s back in the day. The 380 carbine was that fit for the home defense gun because they had that one caliber. This is the exact same thing. So if you're new in this game and you've bought the 30 Super Carry handgun in some degree and you want something a little more to hold on to and shoot, you're only, you're only buying one kind of ammo, this thing kind of fits that bill right in with your handgun that you've got. So still high point, still lifetime warranty, 10 round magazine, just like we normally have. Straight blowback action, but yeah, 30 super carry. It's about like as soft shooting as the 380. You find it somewhere between the 380 and the nines. Man, sadly, I haven't shot this yet. I'm hoping to shoot this thing after this show because we just got these things in there that fresh and new. You know, we had a fuck couple out uh, for uh, T&E, um, but no, I haven't shot it. I've been told that, yeah, it's pretty comparable between the 380 and nine carbines. The 380 carbine's like a 22. It's, it's awesome. The nine is, simple enough because it's nine so yeah it's got to fit somewhere in between there and should be pretty soft do you guys know if there's really improved ballistics with a uh, longer barrel on, on 30 super carry uh, yeah, you know you guys probably are the first people making this uh, a carbine configuration of it yeah i've seen a little bit of that data not a whole lot of it it is cooking a little hotter obviously the handguns because you're talking 16 half inch barrel so it's moving so, i mean it's got some performance to it that if you thought 30 super was a little anemic kind of a handgun not so much with the carbine so yeah it's like the, the 21st century 30 carbine, M1 carbine, I guess. Kind of. Kind of. I think it kind of is going to fall into that. And this also is uh, threaded, right? So you can yeah, suppress it? Yeah, still half 28 thread, just like the 9mm and the 380. So, yeah, you can suppress this thing and have more quiet fun with it. You know. Yeah. And now that you guys have a, a magazine for 30 Super Carry, that's, that's one of the main design differences, I guess. So 30 Super Carry handguns coming down the pipe? Uh, maybe. I'll say that. Maybe. Not no. <laughs> not yes, but not no. No, yeah, definitely not no. Not yes for sure, but maybe. You know, We'll see. Right on. And so, you guys have a price point and an availability date planned for these things? Uh, these things will be shipping here real soon, like within the next week or so. And price point, I believe, is like three twenty-five on the cargo. So, yeah. Still keep um, it affordable, man. So you guys have been spending a lot of time working on this. Is that going to push the release of the Yeet Cannon back a little further? You heard it here first, ladies and gentlemen. No. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Yeet Cannon indefinitely delayed. We are a 30, carbine, or 30 super carry shop now. Well, thank you for walking us through the rifle, and uh, thanks everybody for watching. Stay tuned. We got a whole lot of stuff coming from NRAM 2023 on TFB TV and TFB TV Showtime.